Hey, how's it going everybody? Uh, so we have another test today. Um, we've got the railgun set up just the same as yesterday. We're going to do a control test. So for that, here I have two projectiles. Uh, here's the one that was fired yesterday. Here's the one we're going to fire today. We're going to fire it without um, the rails active. So just so everyone knows they're the same weight, i got a scale here. So here's the one we fired yesterday. It's a little off. 4.3 grams. Here's one we're going to fire today. Pretty much 4.2 grams, so a little bit lighter. All right. Anyway, I have a king size sharpie here because the spray paint was kind of creepy. So, all right. So here's Mr. Cantaloupe Head. He's happy because he's not going to get hit with 1.3 kilojoules today. He's just going to get the air pressure. Bolts back, as you can see, into the chamber there. We're just going to put this slug of aluminum in there. Slide it forward slightly, just so it's chambered. And then the way we load this is we simply just press down on this piece of pneumatic tubing and locks into place. We're not going to turn the rails on today because obviously we're doing a control test. Uh, but we are going to turn on the CO2 pressure. Notice I haven't touched the regulator. The regulator is in the same position as yesterday. Um, I don't really have any way of verifying that, but you're just going to have to take your word for it. And we're going to fire. In three, two, one. All right, so same deal as yesterday. We're just going to cut this guy open. Right there is proof positive. So as you can see, the armature lodged itself about only a half an inch into the cantaloupe. Only a half an inch. Versus the other one that had lodged itself all the way over here. Um, looks like it, it kind of came to a rest here and then bounced off of this inner spongy lining. Uh, so clearly the rails imparted some serious velocity. That is pretty incredible stuff. So 100 meters per second gets it there. 250 gets it there. Incredible.